Hey guys, what's up Virgo? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it how you need to. Also remember it's a general reading, so just take what yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. If you've seen that five of wands. I keep trying to pop out. So that kept trying to pop out. So um, that's about conflict. That can be about change or kind of resisting. I mean, it could be for a lot of reasons, but conflict in some way. Sometimes that can be with someone else. That can be with self. Media future. What's the word for the birds, please? You got the Knight of Cups. Could be dealing with the water sign. There could be an age difference. Also, it could be a distance. Or some pain that was caused around the situation. Libra energy for the outcome. Something is trying to work itself out. To balance itself out. There could be a legal situation around something. But on either side, you have this Knight of Cups and the Justice. So this is a lot of love, emotions, and things trying to work out. In the middle of it all, you have that Three of Swords. So that could be a situation that caused emotional pain. It also could be some type of distance there. Show me this Knight of Cups, please, for Virgo. Thank you. The Hermit, that's your energy. Tell me about this Knight of Cups for Virgo, please. The Seven of Cups. Somebody's had you on, and the Six of Cups. Somebody's had you on their mind a lot. Looking at pictures or vice versa. This could be a younger water sign. It doesn't have to be. This could be something around someone from your past. A sweet friendship. Somebody's been doing a lot of daydreaming, fantasizing. A very, like, romantic kind of way. But um, also a very shy one. For some, this could be around uh, someone that you're dating. Friends with benefits situation. But also looks like there's somebody who's trying to, who really values this friendship, this love, whatever it is to you, you know, it's trying not to lose it. But there feels like there's been some stubbornness there in the background. Show me this Three of Swords, please, for Virgo. So this is the obstacle. The Three of Swords is pain. It, oh, okay. All right, you have an incredibly shy person here. Um, the Chariot and the Page of Cups. Cancer energy. Somebody, okay, first of all, two ways this is going. One, it could be an apology or somebody just trying to speak up, trying to express how they feel. They're incredibly shy, um, but they do have a lot of love, a lot of emotion. For some, there could be communication. And for others, like I said, this could be an apology. For some, if somebody's at a distance in traveling, um, there could be some type of car troubles. For others, this could also be someone who was incarcerated. And then another way it could go, or all, you know, more than one, it looks like you got the devil there. So whatever that is, could be a Capricorn, could be an ex. It looks like there's somebody that you walked away from to, like, focus on yourself. Like a situation you had to let go of, you had to heal from. But that love's still there. Show me this justice card for the outcome for Virgo. The emotions are real. Looks like somebody is really nervous to speak up and express these feelings or apologize. And also at the same time, like really nervous to get hurt. The justice and the emperor, Aries energy. The emperor takes charge. We went from knights and pages to an emperor. The King of Wands definitely could be an Aries Leo Sag. Doesn't have to be though. This is kind of like a change of energy here. A whole lot of confidence coming over. This could be somebody who 
for some broke your heart in the past. There's a lot of love there, but maybe there's some type of distance, some type of separation. Strong Leo energy. Tell me about the outcome for Virgo. The Two of Pentacles. Hmm. Well, that's kind of like weighing options, trying to figure things out. There's some uncertainty around the Two of Pentacles. And if this is somebody like you've known before and somebody has choices or is always back and forth, something in the background, maybe getting something, someone maybe getting um, some secrets revealed and then something gets ghosted. So it looks like someone keeps that to themselves. And that's not for all. Give me one more for the outcome for Virgo. Just be mindful of situations that kind of kept you in a loop. The death card. Scorpio energy. I keep seeing that two of wands and the five of pentacles. So it's like somebody has a choice and on one side they're ghosting something. Still some uncertainty. A lot of emotions, though. It's been on their mind a lot. It's also been some confusion, and it feels like it's still there. All right, Virgo, I hope this helps. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that information is below as well. You guys take care, and I will see you next time. Bye.